This is Jackal Fitness. I'm here with Coach Jackson, man. First and foremost, Coach, thank you for your time. Um, let's just talk. Clarissa Shields, man. You know, she's pound for pound one of the best fighters right now, man. Just describe that work that she puts in, Coach. Yeah, definitely, definitely. So you saying you've been working on the power with her sitting down on those punches. Definitely. I, 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 okay. you know, she wants it. And she was trying to do hard, but not she, she was rushing herself before. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Range this, so Definitely. If, if anybody can teach you that, it's you. Cause uh, in your day, you know, we uh, we we some connoisseurs of the sport, man. And your day you used to sit down on your punches. You was known for that crap, man. Yeah, bro, I appreciate it. Yeah. Right. Hopefully, you know, she get it and you know, train it to get it. I mean, it's better fight than she Definitely. All right, we got we got a big fight coming up September 28th with Earl Spence Jr. and Sean Porter. How do you see that fight playing out, Coach? It's a very good fight. Um, on paper, yes. Spence is a better fighter. Yes. And you know, if you look at it, he's a better fighter. But you know, the fight depends on what Porter does. Yes. She has to be the pursuer. He has to take Spence out of his comfort zone. Yeah. And the nice thing about Spence, I give I give Spence credit for one thing. The fight with Garcia, he showed me a discipline. Whatever man that is his uh, coach. Derek James, yeah. He, he, he did that. Yeah. He didn't get out of it. He didn't go for the knockout. Yeah. He boxed smartly. He did whatever the plan. He executed the plan game plan. So Definitely. I give him credit for that. I, mean, I, I think it's smart to have to do that. Yeah. This is a good fight. I give him kudos for that. This fight here, it depends on what Porter does. Porter has to be the aggressive. Porter has to be the one to initiate it. Because yeah. Spence is strong. He's, he's smart. Yes. You can't, let, you can't let Spence do what he wants to do. Yeah. You make him take him out of his comfort zone and make him fight whatever fight you want to make. So that fight depends on what Porter does. Yeah. Spence comes to fight. Yeah, yeah. You know, box football, he'll box it. If a punch, he'll punch it. Yeah. It depends on what Porter does, what game plan he and his father devise. Yeah. I'm not saying bad people that they get a good plan, game plan, it works. Yeah. If you let Spence do what he wants to do, you're in trouble. So that yeah. fight is a, it's a fight of who, who does what and whose game plan works the best. And can Porter come up with a good plan for the team? Yeah. The son, yeah. But on paper, you get full of Okay. One final question, man. I know you're busy, man. Before I let you go, man. You was a former fighter, former world elite fighter. Now you're a top trainer. What message do you have to the young kids getting into the sport, wanting to be fighters from the amateurs to the young pros? Just give them a word of advice, man. You know, you've been to the mountaintop. Now you train the people to get to the mountaintop. Just tell the fighters what it takes to get there. Stay disciplined, stay focused. Run. Don't, 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 you know, don't rely on you to become a standing condition coach. Yes. Get your butt up in the morning or late at night, whenever it's best time for you to run, run. Yes. Find your good, when you, when you turn pro, find your good professional trainer. Now, keep, if you want to keep your, your amateur guy, that's fine. Yes. Just get you someone that knows the game of boxing. Yes. I'm saying, I'm talking about today's so called trainers. They don't know the game of boxing. You know, okay. Uh, a lot of guys are like mixed people. Yeah. Find you a trainer that understands and knows the game. Yeah. He ain't got to be the top guy, but he needs to be there to teach you the final points of boxing. Yeah. A lot of, a lot of rich, smart things in boxing are falling by the wayside. Yeah. Because my generation, generation before me, it's not like being taught to the younger fighters. Okay. And the guys that know the game now, they didn't know learning. So find yourself a good coach. Yes. Keep, if you, you know, keep it with, in your team with your own coach. But find somebody that knows this game. We can teach you how to become a better fighter than you are right now. Yes. Definitely, man. Once again, man, this is Jackal Fitness. You heard those wise words of wisdom from Coach Jackson, man. Thank you for your time, Coach, and best of luck with your fighter tonight. Thank you for having me. Appreciate yeah. it. Thank you. Thank you.